Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap. Today's Friday, October 9th. Hope everybody had a great week of trading. A plus $457.50 on the day. So a decent little green day. I actually gave a little bit back uh, late in the morning. I was up, I was up closer to a thousand at one point, but a uh, positive green day uh, just as well. So um, let's talk about our Mighty 90 first. Booked $553 on our Mighty 90 trades today. Took a small loser in Apple, a loser in MU, a winner in Boeing, and my biggest winner in Tesla. So biggest winner today was Tesla. Biggest loser was MU overall, uh, but plus 553. And then for the week, plus 242 on our Mighty 90 strategy. No pairs trades the last couple days, but for the week, uh, booked uh, $981.50 on our pairs trades. And then for the runners today, uh, slightly in the red, like I said, biggest loser was MU. Took a loss both on a Mighty 90 and a runner. MU kind of had our number today. Uh, nice winner in Shopify, nice winner in Peloton, winner in AMD, small loser in Tesla, and um, a loser in Facebook, and a small loser in oil. So uh, overall runners for the week plus 430. So uh, for the day, like I said, plus 45750. And for the week, plus $1,653.50. Let's take a look at the charts. I'll show you a little bit about what we did today. Let's start with MU, our loser. So when we had this, uh, MU started off strong and then had this big push lower coming into this pivot, got a higher volume spike. And so we were looking for a bounce off this pivot and never got it, just kind of kept going. So we just cut, cut our losses pretty quick and took a little loss there. And then as the morning progressed, it just started really consolidating under this pivot. So I ended up taking a short, looking for a continuation down and it just grinded higher, ended up adding a little bit to it at this pivot, started to roll over, but then just grind, continue to grind higher. And as you can see, it did the rest of the day. So I ended up just getting out, taking a loss on MU. Uh, Tesla, my biggest winner, uh, so really nice mighty 90 trade here, had this big push higher as it was pulling back, got a higher volume bar, ended up getting in right here, right around this area, and then added to it right here as we got another push down and another higher volume and was able to ride that up uh, for a nice winner, actually just to about right there. Uh, so took a nice winner in Tesla. Uh, let's see, a couple others, uh, Shopify. Shopify was a nice quick one. Uh, Shopify is a pretty big stock, right? It's trading over a thousand dollars. And so ended up just getting in this with one contract uh, to start. I was going to add to it if I got the opportunity, but as it pushed up, started to consolidate. If it came back down to the pivot, I was going to add to it, but just had one. And so caught a nice little runner in Shopify for a few, quick few hundy. Uh, Peloton, another nice runner. And actually this wasn't a run. This was more of a walk, but <laughs> Had this big push higher as it started to consolidate here, got long for a continuation and rode this thing basically all the way up to the pivot and, uh, and, and took a nice profit out of Peloton. AMD, small profit on the short side. Uh, it was weak all morning after I think got a downgrade. So once it broke below this pivot, as it bounced back up, got short right here and just rode this thing down for a little nice little profit there. Uh, Facebook, I took a loss and then oil, I took a loss. Let me look at oil for you. Um, oil was, had an interesting move. So this thing was kind of just consolidating all morning. And then let me get this zoomed in for you. Consolidated and then it spiked up and and then it kind of pulled back and so i was just I, I just i picked a point right around here i was looking for a continuation higher after that after that spike but it ended up just flushing me out so just cut my losses pretty quick and took a little loser there but like i said for the day plus 457.50 for the week plus 1653 dollars and 50 cents so green is good uh, look forward to uh, doing some more live trading with you all next week. Uh, check out the live stream room. Uh, I've got a calendar in there. We are going to be doing something a little bit different going forward. I'm going to I'm going to post some some different dates where we uh, come on a little bit later in the morning so that we can stay a little bit later. Uh, that way I can get in and get my my portfolio alerts done for our, for our core 
income portfolio. Uh, so keep your eyes on that calendar. That's where, we'll, where we will be posting the updated days and times. And everybody have a great weekend. Look forward to some more trading next week. Cheers.